So, if molten salt pebble bed reactors can be passively safe and less expensive, why is every single organization shown here investigating, if not dedicating themselves entirely, to the pursuit of liquid fuel? There's supreme advantages of dissolving the fuel and fish products in the fluorides because you can add and subtract at will. Solid stuff is always going to be expensive fabrication. And what do you do with the spent pebbles? They have an inner carbon core surrounded by a triso matrix, surrounded by an outer layer of graphite. Every time we defuel a pebble, you can actually assay these pebbles using gamma ray spectroscopy to uh, discern how, what the burn up is of this pebble and whether it should be placed back into the core or whether it should be put in storage. Then what do you do with the spent pebbles? There was that much more manufacturing and engineering and thought going into these pebbles. But ultimately, from a macroscopic or 50,000 foot view, you still have the same waste problem. Except it's now in a far more engineered and therefore much more difficult medium in which to go extract that waste and process it.